When asked, what kind of a person are you, you should think of personality traits that contribute to the person you have become today. Are you funny, intelligent, outgoing, shy? These tend to be easy questions to answer, but the more important and difficult question is, why are you who you are? Most people believe the environment they were raised in has made the largest impact on who they are today. <clears throat> Many also believe life-changing events affect who they are now and have shaped the way they handle other situations throughout life. It is easier for most people to say their environment has shaped who they are instead of saying it is just their genes that have made them the way they are. We are aware that physical attributes like height, eye color, hair color, and body type are genetic. We have also found that many illnesses are genetic as well but almost no one thinks of genes as a main factor in who they are psychologically. Studies have been conducted to find if nature or nurture mainly contributes to our personality. By taking 56 pairs of identical twins and raising them in separate environments, psychologists Bouchard and Lichen later compared these twins and their similarities to identical twins raised together. During weekly visits, each pair of twins completed about 50 hours of testing, including four personality trait scales, three aptitude and occupational interest inventories, and two intelligence tests. They also created a list of household belongings, a family environment scale, and answered a life history interview. The large amount of data collected gave researchers correlations that the environment the twins are raised in is not responsible for individual differences. The findings clearly show that genetic factors account for a large portion of human characteristics. The data found is important when showing identical twins who grew up in separate environments appeared the same physically but also had very similar personalities much later in life. Critics of Bouchard and Lichen tend to agree with the behaviorism theory that all human behavior is controlled by environmental factors. As humans, we generally want to think people learn certain behaviors because that would prove that positive life experiences can make an impact on us. Critics also believe that Bouchard and Lichen's data has not been fully published, so it cannot be trusted. However, recent findings continue to indicate that human traits and behaviors are mainly influenced by genes.